Welcome back to your Feel Good Breakfast Show. It's Expresso here on SABC3. And time for us to do another easy DIY with our art director, Matana Katz. And I hear she's got something really fantastic in store for us today. Matana, how are you? I'm good, thanks. And you? I'm so good. Now listen, um, you've seen those Instagram videos that Kat's always putting up, right? Of him playing <laughs> the piano. And he's always trying to position his phone or his tablet in a weird way. <laughs> You're making tablet stands for us today. Tablet and cell phone stands. Beautiful. Okay, so how do we get into it because I didn't know you could make it yourself. Yeah, no, it's it's super, super easy. Um, I just wanted to point out a few things. Um, it's always great also to look at um, tablet stands that are probably South African yeah. and are local designers. So we've I got agree. these beautiful um, solid timber stands today <gasps> from Ian Lindsay Designs. Wow. Um, and what I love about it is that the design is so simple and it's so elegant um, and I would love to have one. But if you don't have one, yeah. you can always make one. <laughs> this is beautiful. This is beautiful. But it's I like really, the fact really that we beautiful. can make it ourselves. Exactly. All right. So very, very simple. Um, let's go through what we would need. So a very sharp knife. You would uh -huh. need definitely parental supervision for this. Yes. Don't let kids do this by themselves. Um, some spray paint of the color of your choice. Okay. Some plastic toy dinosaurs. Nice. Um, some super glue. Some silicone. And then these suction cups. Oh, which you can get at most hardware stores. Fantastic. So the first thing you would do was you would cut your dinosaur in half, okay. as you can see what we've done. Um, and then you would spray paint it the color of your choice. Nice. So if you're doing a tablet stand, you'd use a larger dinosaur, as you can see over here. Of course, yeah. Um, and if you are doing a cell phone stand, then you'd be using a little one, a as you can see over dinosaur. here. So right. very simple. We are going to fill the inside of the hollow part of the dinosaur with okay. silicone. That's already been spray painted. It's already spray painted. Gold. I chose gold. It's my favorite color. Okay. <laughs> um, so we're going to just literally, we're going to just fill it um, oh, with the silicone. Fill the inside. Exactly. Fill it inside with silicone. Okay. And this okay. really helps kind of um, bond it properly and get everything sticking really well. Yeah. Um, then we're going to take the super glue. So you can help me with this. Okay. So you're very going to carefully, you're going to put super glue on the outlines around the okay, dinosaur's edge. Not a problem. There we go. So I'm super gluing the edge of the dinosaur's tummy. Yes. All right. And it's going to help stick the suction cup to it, get everything nice and sturdy. So it's going to really help um, with the standing point of it once you've put okay. it up. I thought you were going to glue the phone to it. I'm like, yeah, that's a permanent stand. <laughs> yeah, no, that, forever that, that's and not going to work. <laughs> then we take our suction cup, very easy, and you're going to put it through, squish it into the silicone and so it sticks onto the sides where you also put the super glue. And then you leave it to dry. So once it is dry, then it comes up like that wow. and it works so well and it's so easy and cute Stop. and I love it. That is so easy. That took you like under two minutes to do. It was easy DIY. Wow, thank you so much. I like that. And, and of course, <laughs> it'll be able to do this on its own. So now, Kat, I think you already know what's your birthday present, right? And I'm going to make it all by myself. Over to you guys in the kitchen. Cut dinosaur in half. Spray paint dinosaur. Fill dinosaur with silicone. Stick suction cup on dinosaur with super glue.